actually. Oh yeah, so let's wait for him. I'm just outside. I don't know where he'll come from. I don't know if it's from that side or this side. So yeah, let's wait. Just waiting for him to come. <laughs> I'm so excited, you people. I don't know where he'll come from. Can see him in the lift, so yeah, let's be patient. Finally, so we're just at the entrance waiting for him. He'll come from that uh, that area. So yeah, let's continue waiting. This is my outfit of the day. I had forgotten to show you. Just a simple outfit. What's up my good people? Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for always coming back to watch my videos. In case it's your very first time to come across this YouTube channel, welcome. My name is Dim Wango and kindly consider smashing that subscribe button. Tap on the bell icon for notifications. Give this video a thumbs up and feel free to drop a comment down below. So guys, right now I'm in Amatachu. That's why you can see the camera is kind of shaking. And so today we're going to meet Bay for the first time. I are you ready? So without further ado, let's head there. What's up my people? I'm already in Nairobi heading to Kipandero. So it's early morning here in Nairobi and kind of I'm just frustrated because imagine I just ordered an Uber then the Uber guy was supposed to meet at Kencom for those who know then suddenly he's just telling me get another Uber to take you to that place. You know I was so annoyed to an extent I decided to uninstall the Uber app and downloaded the Bolt because man that's not fair. Anyways I'm not complaining so much so we're heading there. My young brother is seated right behind me. I don't know if you can see him. You can wave. I'll be there in 10 minutes time. It's 10 a.m. I'm kind of late. Like being late is like one of my weaknesses. I'm never on time. So yeah, let's head there and let's see how it goes. Guys, we just reached where my brother was. Just this building up here. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, that's Emily Hotel. So we're just waiting for him in a few. I know he'll be here. I can see him in the lift. So yeah, let's be patient. Finally, Ayamara is here back home. Oh yeah, so let's wait for him. I'm just outside. I don't know where he'll come from. I don't know if it's from that side or this side. So yeah, let's wait. Just waiting for him to come. <laughs> I'm so excited, you people. I don't know where he'll come from. I don't know where he'll come from. Uh -huh. <laughs> this building is so tall. You can see it super, 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 super tall. There's a lot of noise because this hotel is just at the highway because you can see the main gate is there. So bear with me so let's wait for him so they are saying we just have to record our details so let's just do it you know because we just have to follow the rules so we're just at the entrance waiting for him he'll come from that uh, that area so yeah let's continue waiting so meet my brother and sister <laughs> finally, finally, finally. Oh, I'm Mara is here. Hey, what's up, sis? What's up? Good, good, good. Welcome. Thank you, thank you. Wow. Yeah, finally, my brother is here. I'm so happy to see him, you know? Yeah. I have to introduce myself to the gatekeeper. Uh -huh. because I arrived here last night mm -hmm. and nobody knows about this. Okay. So it looks really beautiful. <laughs> I think we should take a photo from there. So I okay. It on my okay. Yeah. So my sister, her name is Dee Mwango, and my tall brother here. <laughs> So we finally got to where my brother is staying in his Yo, hotel. Yo, what's up, what's up, people? 
So I'm staying in this Airbnb. Yeah. It's a little messy, but I just arrived last night, so... Yeah. Maybe later I'll do a house tour of yeah, the sure. B in Nairobi, and also Kenya. I'm, I'm moving to a different one, so you can uh -huh. do two videos if you want. Exactly. Yeah. <laughs> so we have a, a homage here. Yeah. <laughs> there you can wave. Yeah, he's a homie. <laughs> yeah, he's a homemate. Then my brother has already said previously. You can show them the room actually <laughs> if you want. It's just in a mess. Okay, so let me get to show you how this room looks like. And what's the price here per night? Uh, it's uh, yeah, uh, twenty-seven dollars. Yeah, so yeah, let me get to show you how. It, it could looks. be actually it could be cheaper because I'm mm -hmm. using Airbnb. They have mm -hmm. to take their part, mm -hmm. and also there's some commissions and uh -huh. many other crazy stuff. But should be around twenty dollars. Yeah, night. Yeah. So let's get to check it out. Yeah. So our small kitchen here, uh -huh. and uh, you can actually cook. We have very Utensils. nice. The utensils here for uh, maybe two or three people and uh, what else we have a microwave it's functional as you see right there we have a fridge here very nice small oh, fridge at the same time here we have oh. all cooking utensils it's actually one of the best Airbnb I've ever stayed not only in Kenya, but I think around the world where I've been to. Because they have a lot of very small details. Yeah. So you can make your coffee here. You don't have actual. Yeah. But another thing is, you still give kettle. You this kettle, okay? So, what else? One thing that is very unique with this place is it's run by a guy. Mm -hmm. Not a female, I mean a male. And look. He has yeah. too many knives. Wow. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> too many, you know? My yeah. Let me place it here. And also, this wow. one here. Too many of them. Too many. <laughs> I think he went to a supermarket and just, I just bought it. Yeah. And he was like, I'm done with this thing. Yeah. Apart from that, there is um, coffee. Nice cave. Yeah, and also. This one here we have uh, tea bags. So if you're not a coffee person, you have tea. Actually, in Kenya, people like uh, tea leaves. Tea. Yeah, more than coffee. Yeah. Actually, even me. That's, that's, uh, this is masala. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, here we have a toaster. Mm -hmm. So you can do some toasting, bread toast, bread. and everything. And uh, it's very clean, neat. And here they have uh, all different of glasses, maybe. Yeah. Wine, wine glass, water. Right you can see they have the yeah. wine, water, maybe just normal juice. Uh -huh. And uh, here is very important is because there's Netflix here, uh -huh. and also there is uh, YouTube, so you can really enjoy. Yeah. And I like the fact that they have this chair. I don't know if it's a chair or coach. Yeah. This one here. For example, right now I have visitors around here. No, no, why are you moving? I don't know why just, you're moving. Just it, just it. Sorry, sorry, just, it's very, it's very okay. It's very so now normal. I have visitors here at least yeah, now. They can, they can sit, sit there, and it's a uh, a neat bed over here. King size bed, <laughs> king size bed. Yeah, you know I am told the difference between a king and queen size bed uh -huh. is just these curves. If it's like oh. this, this makes it king. If it has a curve here. Mm -hmm. Then it makes it queen. Hey, didn't that's, know that. That's all. Uh, <laughs> yeah, what else? So I've learned a new thing. Also, inside there you can you can uh, write your own. maybe show. Here yeah, wow. they have you can iron your clothes, clothes. And there's an iron box right there. Mm -hmm. One thing I like is this white bed sheets. Yeah. That's because this tells you this guy is really dedicated with his business because after use, he has to wash them. I, I really don't like when I go to places and you find they have maybe this type of color of this sheet. Because this, this means uh, maybe the last person was here, or the last three persons, and they, the owner reused it just... He, he, he put some little fresh mat yeah. to feel fresh. But too. since time immortal, you've, you've always loved white bed sheets, yeah, even back in the village. Yeah, because <laughs> it, it, shows, it shows like... Eh? Maybe yeah. it's getting dirty or something. And I think you've shown that. Yeah. Way. And they have hot, hot showers. showers. 
Yeah, and uh, there's also Wi-Fi here. It's not as that strong as I expected it, mm -hmm. but I think that's the only thing I'll say he should at least. And it's next to Nairobi. Yeah. The capital. Above they have a swimming pool which is shared. So well, later maybe we, we can show it. The swimming pool. Okay, okay that's, all. that's all guys. Yeah. Remember to subscribe yes, for more videos. Subscribe to D Mango, please. <laughs> Check her out, okay. 10K. Okay, 10K, not to 10K subscribers. <laughs> also, check him at Ayamara YouTube channel. Oh, I forgot know? actually to mention this. Maybe it's a bonus point. Yeah. Is, uh, the let's, main... say, let's say you're new here in Nairobi mm -hmm. and you don't know anything, anybody, any hotels, so you don't know where to eat. Mm -hmm. There's a menu here with a phone number yeah. you can easily call, and they're going to bring you any type of food here. I'm seeing even they are selling fish here for the most, $6. The most expensive meal here is six dollars. Wow! Breakfast you can tell from this. Mm -hmm. You can tell. Uh, oh, one dollar. Yeah. One and a half dollars. Imagine the most expensive food here is six dollars. Six dollars, so and that's fish. Yeah. You know. So and you can have really exclusive things like coffee, yeah. for example, for this, and even you can make coffee for yourself right there. Sure. Yeah. That's all. So guys, time to check how the washroom looks like and kindly subscribe if you haven't and let me get to know what you think in the comment section. So this is how basically it looks and it looks so nice, so clean, well taken care of. I just love their mats. It makes the washroom to look more bright and you know, more neat. They have the washing detergents over that side. The bowl itself is so clean, well taken care of man. They have a wall mirror here where you can get to look at yourself adjust yourself even while brushing your feet they have a tap here or rather a sink with clean water from the tap as you've just seen they have a hand wash because you just have to sanitize all the time there's a hand towel and finally that's where you get to take your shower from so that's the end of the video kindly consider subscribing if you haven't already see you soon on my next one guys i love you